This was cool. The eco station. They have this cool lore, like they were gonna terraform Arrakis to make it like a I don't know Earth like. They abandoned it. But look at this equipment. It's an old ecological testing station. Yeah. First off, they why might... would an ecological testing station be so large? Like, what are we measuring here? What are we testing? Yeah, they're, they're going straight to execution. They're not testing anymore. Yeah. So I, I would assume like measuring the atmosphere, you just have like devices up on the surface. You want to measure the surface. You have, you do some digging and you measure that. Nothing, no big equipment there. So a testing station would be like, we're going to test the terraforming procedure. And maybe they're going to, in, they're going to grab this atmosphere in this large area and like try to add moisture to it and see what happens. The the best answer I can come up with right now on the spot is that they had ideas of making underground caverns so that they can collect oh. water. Okay. And this is like their first model of it. Like if we make this cavern underneath the ground where it should be cool, maybe we can make a damp place and given the shape of a thing, then the water doesn't evaporate. Uh, maybe. Okay. 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 I like that. And then their test. This is a testing of the process. Yeah. Okay. I like it. And that's why it's so big, because you need a lot of atmosphere on Arrakis to get water. Yeah, I guess so. I like yeah, it. yeah, because it, if it's small enough, then the temperature inside the chamber can rise, and then water will evaporate away. So you need some minimum size that can keep cool enough. To, uh, mm -hmm. maybe. Okay. I meant to tame the planet, free the water locked beneath the sands. Arrakis could have been a paradise. The work had begun, but... Then the spice was discovered. Suddenly, no one wanted the desert to go away. So, so I understand that they didn't want the desert to go away because the desert, the spice needs the desert for some reason. So they don't destroy the desert. They don't terraform it. It's important. The spice is important for the entire empire. Okay. Don't. Are they not allowed to make domes? Are they not allowed to localize the changes? I mean, is the that's entire right. planet desert? Right. I mean, right. is this a Tatooine situation? I, I want I want one lake. <laughs> I want one lake <laughs> so that we can have easy access to water and so that my people can go have like pool parties in the summer. Like, right. I don't need a mine from every square inch of the planet. Right. So I could, and, I, and then say, say if I did make one lake, it would somehow poison the entire surface, which I find unlikely, but let's say that happened. Can I not create a dome where I, I create right. a dome? where I have nice, so my Gosh. people who are doing mining in the harsh environment can come into the dome and they have a nice environment. Relax where they a little bit. Relax a little bit. Yep, have a and, cerveza, and sure. In addition, they found spice, which is super expensive, which means getting the financing to build all this infrastructure should be really easy. It should be actually <laughs> easier now. That's right. That's like, it's, like, it's like saying we have found too much gold in this land to have a hot tub. Like, <laughs> what? What? Like, the more gold you have, the easier it is to have a hot tub. Yeah. Bankers would be like, can I give you money? Because I know you're good for it. Because look at all the gold you have. It was like, oh, look at all the collateral you have. The entire planet of spice. Yeah. So, in fact, I want to get in on the game. Can I Can I, Can I? I build stuff? Can, can I build I that out? for you? I, wa yeah. I want to cut. I want to cut. Yeah. Get, me, get yeah. in the game. Yeah. Instead, they shut it down. That makes... What? Like, Not only do we want you to get spice, we want to be mean about it. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why are we being mean about it? You I'm get the not. best workers... If you have the best working conditions. That's right. There would be so money. much perks. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. They would have, like, cafeterias where they gave you free food so you can stay there and work longer. Heck, yeah. So, as I understand, like, in modern day, the, the workers who go out on the oil rigs, they go mm -hmm. out for, like, a three weeks at a time, four weeks at a time or something. But they get paid a lot. And yeah. they get, like, it's like they get lots of time off when they come back. Yeah. Like, lots of money, kind of shitty on the oil rig. Rough and hard for a short time. Well, you get paid big and you get the perks of like these long vacations and different mm -hmm, things. Mm -hmm. Like you could set up a system like that here. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that or you're just asking people to grind in the pain. Grind grind in the heat. Grind. Don't you don't get to have right. a nice bath ever. Right. You don't get to have a nice house. It's just, just gray and brown and not right. fun. Great. Not fun. No. And you're sandblasting your asshole to wipe. That's right. But I guess if it's callous enough, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. 